I'm very hungry, so <laughs> don't feel bad about it. Cheers. We just had a moment of PTSD for the Kuli Wow Trail here. Wow, wow. Wow, wow. The little community looks just like the uh, Wailupe Loop trailhead. Last week, Ethan said that we will never do a ridge line again. <laughs> and here we are, oh. beginning of the week, Monday. <laughs> Oopsies. Ridge lining. What Woo can I say? You can keep a ridge out of a man, but you can't keep the man out of the ridge. Precisely. Thank you. <laughs> this is a very good sign. Both a good sign and also indication that this shouldn't be too We're bad. We're gonna be okay. <laughs> Forehead's on point. <laughs> Taco Monday. This plant here is the worst plant in all of Hawaii. <laughs> She's... They're, on, they're on every ridge and they cut you up. She speaks the truth. <laughs> Careful. <laughs> Clouds kill us. I've been losing a lot of sleep. We've been staying up late. Tell the stories talking into the night as we wait for the light of day. There's a stillness that's in the air. Like the time just waits But now my mind is floating off on a cloud And my heart starts to race And you tell me I'm the speck of pole From the orange peel right high But I'm thinking you're the Brooklyn Bridge Lit up at night How do you feel about that stunt, Sarah? Good. Did you enjoy your run, Ethan? <laughs> yeah, I did. I say, Sarah, tell me when I should turn around. Silence. We needed a chance to cool off and have some fun before some service later in the day. So we went to the China Walls near Honolulu. Super cool down there. Oh. I'm glad you came out when you did. Shining like the spark that lights the candles flame. A sleepless broken makes its way from night to day. So we just finished up with a little like hillside restoration project. We wanted to improve on our volunteerism, do a little bit more of that as we're here. I think today our biggest takeaway was just the fact that we have um, an obligation to the land that we live on um, just to, you know, take care of it. And we just need to take care of the beautiful things in our lives for not only ourselves, but for future generations. Thought we'd give you a quick description of this hike. It's called the Olamana Trail. It's these three peaks. They're not like super high or anything, but they're just like very sharp looking peaks. It is quite beautiful here on the Royal Hawaiian Golf Course <laughs> to get to the trail. We'll take it. Cause I don't wanna change the things that you and I Here comes George of the Georges of the Jungle. <laughs> and she's a little nervous now. Don't worry, our main act. Beautiful swing. 
Unfortunately, our little snorkeling session here at Mackay Pier was cut short by a little bit of fear of sharks. <laughs> Sarah. <laughs> How was it? Cool. I heard there's sharks on the North Shore. Well, Ethan had some blood coming out of his knee from a little earlier accident. It's cleaned up now because it got cleaned up in the water. Shark's so. paradise. Reggae, 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 reggae muffin, yeah. Is it the part of Hawaii that we have not shared yet. Sarah, don't show them. Just kidding, this is a joke. We actually live in pure paradise. <laughs> Nothing wrong with what living here. Renting a kayak is $100 for a day. And then Ethan stumbled upon this big trailer of kayaks. Said trailer. You can buy a kayak for $350. for unlimited uses. It's tricky. We'll talk about it. We bought a kayak. On to our first adventure in the kayak. Ethan is taking us <laughs> to this island over here. on how to get to the cliff jumping. Contemplating the jump. Just turns me on and now I'm stuck in it. Yeah, we didn't pull it up very far on the beach. We, we've got our paddles out here. Our arms are tired. But this is working. It's our power now. So I'm crossing the line. If I'm moving close. <laughs> you got this, Sarah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> As part of our push to do more volunteering, we helped out at this community garden called Yo Garden in Waimanalo. Here, Ethan, you want to show them the trench you dug? You, yeah. you dug Dug that trench on that side. I feel pretty good about it. You should. Half, maybe like a quarter of it. Then I'm going to finish this one. Got some ginger, turmeric, and baby, baby bananas. bananas. Sarah wants a farm now, so. Uh-oh. This was a good day. <laughs> Organic. Some banana. Some banana. Going to a pool, but it seems like there's not very much water going to the pool. Hopefully this means it's not muddy, but that means not much swimming. If we only knew how wrong we were, let's talk about mental health. For the past few hours, I've been a big grumpy. Grumpy pants. Grumpy pants. So, finally took a nap and feel much better. Taking care of yourself is really important. For the first week or two while we were in Hawaii, I was focusing a lot more on packing our days full of activities and less on taking time to relax and just sit back, which may seem counterintuitive with the lifestyle of living in Hawaii. 
Now having taken a step back and looking for that balance in our daily schedule, I feel a lot better. And it's nice to be able to learn more about myself as we're here in Hawaii. But enough of this kind of stuff, let's get back to the fun. We just met the nicest tour guide at the Ho'olumia Botanical Gardens. He had a very nice voice and very helpful. So. Wrap my arms up tight round you Standing on the platform and drinking and talking We could stay here all night Also, you've got to see Sarah's trick here. She has one of the greatest tricks I've ever seen that she's setting up right here. She makes a little cradle for herself. And she puts her towel down. Comfort. Don't hate me. Don't hate me. <laughs> Things to pay me And I don't know how you did, but you just hit and I wish I could go back now And I wish I could go back now Standing on the platform and drinking This is what can always get us to buy Sarah wanted just one, I convinced her to get two How would you rate it Sarah? Right now we are in calm after the storm meaning the waves are poop because it stormed last week so instead of surfing we decided to try our luck a little bit of bodyboarding if we had any doubts before whether we looked like tourists or not the lifeguard made it very clear we do <laughs> he Hello. uh he scoped us out immediately and said yeah that area is probably not good for you guys. <laughs> so here we are. Some crazy stuff. <laughs> Lifeguard knows what he's talking about. Just keep talking, and I'm wondering what comes next. Just keep on walking. Like I jumped because I did so very <laughs> We just thought it would be a good idea to capture our little evening walk that we go on fairly regularly in our little neighborhood. We live by the beach. We're very close. <laughs> what in the world? And we had no idea all along. There's some things that we may never understand, right Sarah? Like why you would go to the surf rider when you're right next to the beach, but I guess we may never know. <laughs> 